How important is it to experiment in your sex life? Hi everyone, this is Martha. I'm a relationship counselor and clinical sexologist. Of course, it's so important to experiment because it is through little experimentations and play that we try to figure things out and we become more confident over time. Also, just because something works, it doesn't mean that you always have sex in the same way. It can become a bit boring. We are creatures of habit and sometimes what you like may not be what your partner like. I do know of a lot of people, they actually would prefer creative things, new things or different things. And so it's really important to understand that who you are and what you like may be quite different from your partner. And so this spirit of experimentation allows both of you to play, to learn together and to be creative because when we are experiencing different kinds of sensation in our body, guess what? It also opens up our brain. It really allows us to look at life differently, to feel happy and to become more uh, expressed outside of the bedroom as well. So our sexuality actually opens up all kinds of channels in our body, including different parts of our brain that will help us to become more fulfilled, happy and optimal people. So that is an element of fear when it comes to change and doing something that is uncomfortable. However, with time and practice, just by doing little things at a time, we can become better at it. I'm not asking you to do something that you are not comfortable to do, but what are the things that you are comfortable to do or what are some of the things that you may be a little bit curious about? Take small baby steps and always, always honor yourself and always, always honor your partner. Your partner says no, you do have to respect that. You can have a discussion about why this is a no for your partner so that you understand where they're coming from so that maybe you can break it down into smaller steps so that you can both have something that you both mutually agree to. So this has been Martha sharing with you some tips about how you can begin to experiment with your partner slowly, one thing at a time, and always with consent. Uh, with a spirit of play and creativity and uh, fun, it's really not meant to be so stressful. So talking about sex does allow it to become better for, it, for you, for both of you. And so it's so important to also work through our own discomfort of communication as well. So this has been Martha. Do subscribe to my mailing list. That's eroscoaching.com where you will never miss a thing.